this time we're better prepared to go through the Game Boy Advance bonus dungeon, which is included on the old Steam version. Oh wait, no, I don't want to go this way. <clears throat> I'm just gonna Hermes Sandals smoke our way out of just about every battle at this point. Because what I had to do in order to prepare for the boss fight that I couldn't get past last time I tried to stream this was get float cast on my party members yet again. I had to travel to the North Mountains, confuse the Gala Cats. Can't fight this uh, Twin Tanya wannabe because it's locked. Quintania killed me several times in my uh, regular playthrough. But I'm going through the bonus dungeon. Um, actually, I ended up uh, doing this off stream last time. and I did take all these stairs, and actually, they do lead to new treasure chests. Oh god, these are awful. I can't afford to have anyone die. If, if someone dies, I have to literally, like, close the game and resume from the quick save. <clears throat> but those blue squirrels are the worst. But I need floats. And I explored, like, everywhere I could. Um, it's pretty wide open. But I got, like, all the chests I think I could, and I think really... The objective right now is to kill this boss. So let's hope it works. Oh, you know what? No, smoke's not gonna do me any good in that fight. Give him white magic so he can cast blink. And then they should all have white magic, it looks like, except for. Yeah, Ferris can dual wield. Incoming! Blink! Blink. Blizzaga Spellblade. Blink. Uh, let's see. Blink stack, so let's blink again on Kral. Let's see. Can you steal from Guild Turtle? It's probably not worth it because he counterattacks. We just have um, Ferris try to attack and hope the attacks connect. Let's berserk Ferris. I know it's risky. Ooh, that's a lot of turtle attacks. Let's blink, Ferris. Oh, Blink Self, and Blink Lena, and soon we gotta do a Kiraga. Let's see. Yeah, I guess you can do it. She's got some pretty good magic. Magic points, I mean. Alright. No, I'm in pretty good shape, we just need to play defensively. Did he come to like four times? Yo, what up, Burn Crow? I had stuck at this boss last time, but this time I was able to get float cast on my party. I'm just gonna rely on Ferris with dual wield Blizzaga enhancers and uh, Berserked 
to be the one to risk the counterattacks. Everyone else, keep casting Blink. Now I'm prepared for when he casts Earthquake when he kills him or when he loses the fight. We'll see how long I can play before I hit a wall. Um, but, you know, maybe I should at least kill the bosses on stream, right? I tried to stream this bonus dungeon before, like about a week ago, and uh, it just ended up not being worth it. Because I, I didn't even fight, like, any bosses, so I was like, alright, well, I died to this boss. Like, I, I fought this boss, I didn't beat any bosses, I should say. I'm pretty sure he's the gatekeeper. Oh, yeah, I think we did it. Yeah. Ooh, okay. That might come in handy. Wait, I did give him smoke, right? Yeah. Alright, who gets the Grand Helm? I'm thinking maybe her. Really? Oh, he's already got the Vishnu vest. That's why it's... Yeah. yeah maybe it's fine. Or maybe I give her the Vishnu vest. Hang on. No. Ah! Give... Because, like, the, the confirm and cancel buttons are, like, reversed. Crystal and Vishnu Vest. Oh no, you know what? He really needs a Vishnu Vest for that magic. So... <clears throat> I guess... He just needs a defense then. Alright. Very well. <clears throat> Interesting, so the Mystic Knight has more magic defense. Or more defense, even. Uh-oh. At least we got a nice prize for killing the guild turtle. What is this? I mean, I, I could fight these guys. Because I already beat the guild turtle. So it doesn't matter if someone, like, dies and, like, I lose float. I won't have to, like, reset. Assuming I don't need float for whatever the next boss is. Whenever that next boss is. Them. He's not so tough. Man, how much health does this thing have, or what? Goodness. regret fighting this guy. Oh my god, slow. I mean, it's not like he's doing a whole lot of damage. Why can't this just be over? Uh, who to do it? Uh, I guess Bart's. I know it. Self. Jeez, so nothing's hitting anymore either? Uh, Poison. At least it's only one enemy. Wow. Definitely not fighting any more of these today. Not on stream. 
Better give me like a lot of um, <clears throat> like money or, or experience or something. This doesn't look like the RNG is really on my side. Holy shit. I might have to cast a Libra on him soon. He's getting out of hand. There we go. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. He probably gives a ton of AP. So there's absolutely no reason to waste my time on that dickhead. Okay. Yeah, all right. This looks like something here, but there's not. All right. Monster in a box? You know what? Fine. We haven't fought these yet. Let's let's try it. Guessing Thundaga Sword maybe. Yo, what up, Prodigy? This is just a victory lap. I've already beaten um, the game and the two super bosses. Now I'm just going through like the uh, post-game epilogue dungeon, which is exclusive to only a couple versions of this game, like the more recently released. So, uh, that's pretty much it. I mean. Once I hit a roadblock, unless I actually finish it, whichever comes first, either I finish it or I get stuck at a boss, then I'll switch to, um, I got a bunch of Mega Man hacks I could look at. Um, I also got a new Mario World hack I'm pretty curious about. You know what? She can actually do that. I don't really remember what lies ahead. I went through this once, like 15 years ago, and I could see why it wasn't memorable. Fuma shurikens can be useful if I've been hoarding them. Yeah, we don't have to fight these guys. I didn't even check to see, did they- oh no, they gave me- wait, was that money or was that experience? I value experience more than money. At this point, at least. Oh no, we're not fighting those. Travel abroad. Alright, let me- Let's see what this guy has to say first. You're a long way from home, kitties. You scared? Some of the most evilly evil beings are sealed up in here, you know. Not running it, huh? Well, if you want to get to where the real bad stuff is, you gotta prove yourselves to me first. So, test, test your might. I want you to go out and catch me a strong monster like a behemoth. That'll do. Got it? I want you to kill it. Just capture it and bring it back here. Try checking out the Titan's Grotto. It's crawling with behemoths. It's past the caves with the waterfalls. Guess what that means? It means that... I can't, um, proceed any further abiding by the four-job fiesta rules. Because I would have to switch someone's job to, um, Beastmaster. Well, I've already done that. So, um, I mean, that's it. Or, no, sorry, I mean, I, I, I can't do that. It's not complying with the, um, four jobs that I, uh, agreed to restrict myself to. Which I've mastered with every character. But, uh, yeah, so we can't, um, switch to beat ma Beastmaster and we're not still doing 4-Job Fiesta anymore, so... May do it, uh, on my own for curiosity, maybe off-stream. Maybe I'll even just do a whole, like, new playthrough and hope I get a Beastmaster, I don't know. Uh, I did get Mimes with every character. I also got, uh, Gladiators. Cannoneer. And Oracle. I did not get, um... Uh, necromancer with anybody. Well, I mean, I'm gonna have to go save my game, I guess, because I killed that one super boss. Um, but at least I got to make use of that banner that I made, showing that um, I killed uh, x Death, Shinryu, and Omega. The banner across the top of the uh, video right here. So underneath my name, uh, next to the Twitter logo, the star means that I killed the last boss, the heart means I killed the super boss, sh boss Shinryu, and uh, the final icon in is a badge for me um, having defeated Omega, which were uh, quite challenging, but uh, videos for that all on my YouTube playlist. So that'll do it for Final Fantasy V 4-Job Fiesta 2021, unless I decide to do another run. I'm, I'm considering...
doing another one under random rules. But if I don't, it'll give me something to look forward to next year. And if I do it, I mean, I've already streamed some Forge Job Fiesta this year, so I don't know if I would do a whole lot more of that anyway. But yeah, um, that's closure for uh, the Forge Job Fiesta 2021. It happened sooner than I expected. Um, kind of a bummer. You know, I, I may still, like, play through it and may stream it at some point. But remember, everybody, this is leaving the Steam store July 27th. July 27th. Right, right now, if you look, if you do a, a search through the Steam store for Final Fantasy V, it'll say Final Fantasy V. It's a pre-order for the new um, Pixel remaster or whatever. And then also, there's the other one that says old version. But the old version, this one, however you feel about the graphics, uh, has more content. And despite how bad the sprites may look here, um, the battles, all the special effects and everything look really good. And it sounds really good. Just a bit buggy with the way that the menu, um, the cursor defaults in the battle menu. And the super, du or the, the um, uh, post-game dungeon, um, the Game Boy Advance dungeon I'm going through right now. Also, really nothing too exciting, at least so far, but maybe it gets better. I don't remember. Didn't really stick in my memory as well as the um, new content they added to Final Fantasy 4 and 6. Um, but speaking of 6, they'll also leave the Steam store. Same date as Final Fantasy 5 old version. Um, however you feel about the iOS versions, they have the Game Boy Advance uh, post-game bonus dungeons with like new ultimate weapons and stuff for every character. New gear, new bosses. Um, you won't be getting that in the soon-to-be-released Pixel Remakes, or Remasters, whatever they're called. So, think about it. Um, you know, I'm, I'm glad I have I might even, if I do another 4 job Fiesta, I'm not promising I'll do it next year. Uh, and if I don't, I'll do it, you know, maybe the following year or whatever. We'll see if I do it every year or not, it just depends year by year. But uh, I could see myself even using this one again. So, thanks so much for watching, and on to the next thing, I guess.